Hi, this is a video that will show you how to create a table of contents in Microsoft Word. All right, so in order to create a uh, table of contents, what you're going to want to do, and again, this first part where me personally, I like to insert a table of contents. I'm sorry, I like to insert a cover page, excuse me. So I'll go to insert cover page and then I will choose a cover page to, to select. And again, this is you can choose whatever cover page that you would like to. Then what you'll do is you'll come down to the second page. The second page, this is where you're going to want to put your table of contents. OK, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this page blank because I'm going to have Microsoft Word create the table of contents for me. So I'm going to go to my third page and this third page this is what I want to start typing my chapter heading so I want to type chapter one and then the title so I'll say this is the problem okay and then I'm going to type chapter two on the fourth page and this will be the solution a few times now again you can have as many chapter headings as you want in your document okay um, I am just have putting these two just to show you how to create your table of contents so now to tell Microsoft Word what I want in my table of contents I'm going to highlight okay click on my references tab add text level one now you're going to notice that my um, my formatting has changed here some. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing for my uh, chapter one. So highlight it, add text, level one. Okay, so I just told Microsoft Word when I create my table of contents, I want these two items in there. Okay. So now I'm going to go back to that second page where I want my table of contents. Now I'm going to click on table of contents, automatic table number two. Now you can choose whatever table you want. This one is an automatic table, but I just like automatic table number two because it says table of contents, whereas this table right here just says contents. This one is a manual table. This kind of just sets the format up for you, but you have to type everything else in. So that's why I like this one because it will create it for me. Okay, so beautiful table of contents created. It automatically adds the page numbers um, into your work as well. Now, for those of you that write a lot, now just say your chapter, you write a lot in chapter one and you end up um, your chapter two ends up being on um, page seven of seven. Okay, ends up on, being on page seven. Now you'll notice that your table of contents has not updated yet. Okay, as far as your page numbers. In order to update your page numbers, again, you're going to go back to your references tab and then you're going to update your table. And then you can update the entire table or you can update the page numbers only. Updating the entire table is if you added another chapter, for, for example, chapter number three. But updating the page numbers only just updates the page numbers. So I'm gonna update my page numbers and notice um, my chapter two is now on the correct page, okay? So there you have it. That is how you uh, create a table of contents in Microsoft Word. I'm sorry, an automatic table of contents in Microsoft Word. All right, great job and talk to you later.